Hello and welcome to another episode of Let's Go Flying. Uh, it's a quick one for you tonight. We're just heading back from Longford, back to Ashcroft. Uh, it should be pretty beautiful because of the scenery. Gary's just uh, over there at the moment. Wait, well, we're not waiting for him anymore because he's, uh, he's got a puncture uh, and uh, sunset's closing in. I made sure he got all sorted. He's, he's just putting the wheel back on, so we're just going to get off now. Um, and yeah, so uh, let's go flying. Stop the flex on. Ah, yeah, he's done the circuit there. Long for traffic, Golf Mike Echo, Golf Zulu, uh, taking off runway 06, long for traffic. You've got, to, I know it looks like I'm hooning about a bit, but you have to make a, a fairly swift left turn anyway. Um, uh, but all I did was uh, make sure I had sufficient speed, uh, retracted the flaps, and uh, then just put a nice little turn in once I'd let the aircraft accelerate to a suitable speed. So uh, it's perfectly within my and the aircraft's capabilities. There's nothing bad about it. No, There's nothing that. dangerous. I like one foot. It's a nice place, isn't yeah, it? And lovely nice people as well. Yeah, for sure. Actually, yeah, I think that's what makes a place. Yeah, definitely. 100%. That or an ice cream bar. What's going on here? Something my, my headset's awfully noisy. And I can't work out why. After what was an exciting departure from Longford, we pointed the nose north and headed for home. It's only a short flight back to Ashcroft, so we stayed relatively low as we soaked in the beautiful Cheshire scenery and enjoyed the calm conditions. What do you think of the views today? It's stunning, but isn't it? Hazy. It is a little bit hazy. It's uh, difficult to pick out landmarks as well when it's like this. Um, and just about Sea Beast and Castle on the nose over there. What was our um, airfield called next to Longford? Uh, sort of Turn Hill. Uh, it's an air, it's an airport. Uh, well, not an airport. It's a, I think it's a gliding site. Well, I'm not really sure what it is actually. I'll do some research into that. I'm not entirely sure. RAF Turnhill was an active RAF base from 1916 to 1976, and it was later retained as a relief landing ground for RAF Shawbury. Need my sunglasses anymore? Even looking into the sun, it's not bright enough to warrant them, I don't think. Do what? Even looking into the sun, I don't think it's bright enough to warrant sunglasses today. Because it's so hazy, it's just taking the taking the, the glare out. Series on radar. Have the news. Oh, there's a, there's a weird balloon thing. Where? In... Nowhere near old. No, no, no. Helicopter stop though. Where? Near us. Where? What? Define, define near us. Oh yeah, it's behind us. Yeah. It's fine. Panic you. You love panicking me, don't you? Uh, so it's 10 to, we've got uh, 25 minutes to sunset, so uh, we'll go around Beeston Castle, I think. Uh, 
so we'll descend down to about uh, a thousand feet around the castle. Switch frequencies Ooh, to Ashcroft. Uh, Gary's cutting it fine behind us. What's he like? Honestly, that's such a Gary thing, isn't it? Oh, yeah. That would happen. It would indeed. So, we've got Beeston Castle on the right hand side, we've got Peckington Castle on the left hand side in just a moment. And then we'll start to turn. Welcome to Trafford Golf from the Ozulu, inbound from the north, join an overhead 1,000 feet. 2-2. Two, two. So thanks for joining us folks, this is a quick one for you today and I uh, hope we get some more content for you soon, so take care.